Hello beautiful people, welcome back. In this video, I will be taking a lot of risk. What? Yes, because today I'm gonna discuss about the most controversial topic, that is thumb versus claw. And we will try to find out which one is the best. Anyways, at first I would like to know your playing style, like whether you are a thumb player or claw. So let me know in the comments box because I read all the comments. Alright, so which one is the best, thumb or claw? Well, you will gonna know that further in this video. Okay. But before that, make sure to throw a brick on the like button and make it broken. What the f Anyways, many players says that if you play with 3, 4 or 69 fingers claw, then you can play like a hacker. But that's bullshit. Thumb and claw players have both advantages and disadvantages. Whenever the topic comes around thumb and claws, many argues that Jonathan plays with thumb and he is still a god. And I would like to kill this argument with my one-liner, that not everyone is Jonathan. One can play claw and still be a noob, and one can play thumb and still stays a noob. It depends on your grind, and on how well you are playing the game. And most importantly, thumb play style is definitely not for non-gyro players. Explanation. Claw players play the game with 4 fingers. But if you play with 5, 10 or 69 fingers, it's also called claws. Thumb players play with just 2 thumbs. To choose the better style, you should base on the squad role you play in your team. You can play with either thumb or claw setting in different roles. However, playing with thumb and still being a pro is quite rare, and obviously it's tough for an ordinary player. And claw is much more easier than thumb. Because in claw, you can do much more movements or stuffs at a time. Therefore, thumb is not for the newbies. Thumb players. However, it does not mean that the thumb players are new because they cannot play with four fingers at once. A lot of pro players are thumb players. It's the best style for supporters in a team. If you take the leading, sniping, and assaulting roles, you better play with the claw setting. Because thumb setting is not for everyone. Besides, thumb setting is not easy in close combat because you need to do a combo of actions and movements, such as crouch, prone, jump, and open scope. Players in those roles shouldn't choose to play with two thumbs because you cannot do all those movements quickly and easily. In addition, the thumb setting is better than the claw setting for gyro players. Then, thumb players with gyroscope can shoot better than claw players and play other roles. Claw players. If you use a claw setting, you can do all actions like crouch, jump, and drop shots. Moreover, it's better for ADS because you can open scope quickly. You can learn the claw settings from pro players and then adjust the control setting based on your preference. So in conclusion, both are best, but the only thing which differentiates them is their comfortability. Claw is easier to use, and thumb is not that easy to use. So at the end of the day, it's your choice. You either pick the easy one, that is claw. Or you can pick the hard ones, that is thumb. And it's quite hard to compare them and come up with the winner. Let me know your opinion as well in the comments. Alright, so that's gonna wrap it up for today, thank you so much for watching. Do leave a like and also subscribe if you want to see me again. And now, enjoy my potato gameplay. Peace. Wait. Excellent work. Wait. Wait. ahead. There can only be one winner. Let's go!
Awesome. Watch out! Watch out! Excellent work! Enemies ahead! Watch out! Watch out! Awesome. Help! Watch out! Excellent work! Enemies ahead! <laughs> 